Let's go to the main work screen in Design Pro and start with a blank business card. All the tools can be accessed via the toolbar. When you open Design Pro for the first time, all the shortcuts to the tools are displayed. Design Pro's basic tools are divided into six groups listed under View, Toolbars, Database, Drawing, Formatting, Navigation, Standard, and Text. We'll cover the most important tools as we create different labels. We'll start by learning the shortcuts to commonly used tools under View Toolbars, we'll turn off each group and add them one at a time. To create a basic business card from scratch, we first need to insert a text box. Under Insert, click Text Box. We're going to add the company name, App Skills On Demand. To add the shortcut insert commands, under View, click Drawing. Here you see the same text box plus insert circular text, draw a line, rectangle, eclipse, polygon, insert barcode, insert serial number, insert date and time. To format the text, under view, add text. Now we'll highlight it, make it bold, make it dark blue, go with 14 point, and we'll make the box fit better, make it wider. Let's center the text horizontally and vertically and move it to our desired position. Let's draw a line and change the width. To add the shortcut for changing the width of a line, add formatting under view. Here's the line thickness. Let's go with 0.02. It's not quite straight, so. Let's add a red border to the text box and a yellow background with our formatting shortcuts. There's a red border and for a background we'll pick this pattern and go with yellow. Click outside and of course that's a little loud and not really what we'd want. So let's add the undo shortcut along with some others and undo it. 
to do so, view toolbars standard undo undo and notice we've also added save print print preview cut and paste along with copy we can also reduce this down to a zoom of 200 percent a little closer to the actual size and now you can see this probably should be centered a little bit better we need to add three more text boxes for our name and title phone and email and the address We'll start with the title and name. Steve Canyon President. Let's make this bold, first highlighting it, bold, 14 point, we want to center it again, vertically and horizontally. Let's squeeze in the box. and adjust it a little more to the center. That looks pretty good. Next text box. We'll elongate this. This will be for the phone and email. 515-663-7924. We'll stick with the Arial 10 point. We'll move over slightly and add the email address. S Canyon at app skills dot com. We'll center this. And that looks pretty good. One last box for the address. Stretch it out. Let's bring this up a little, then this down a little, and move it toward the center a little better. Again, we'll start here and type in 315 ISU for Iowa State University. Research P A R K for Park Ames, Iowa five zero zero one zero dash fifty six eighty seven.
And to distinguish it, let's go with italic and maximo, an interesting font. I'm going to space this a little bit more, center it, and take a look. Very good. Now, let's click File and save this. We'll save it in the Avery Labels file folder and we'll give it a name business card 8371 for the product number and we'll call it version 1 because you may want to do some variations on this we'll save it so we can preview the file later and then click save we'll replace the old one in the next video, I'll cover more tools and techniques for creating professional business cards.